You ever had those dinosaur shaped chicken nuggets? I don't think I ever have. Although I kind of want chicken nuggets now. Thanks, chat. You have Chinese food waiting for you? Yo, Cher with the class. Hello. Hello, Cher. I usually always get the... I always usually get the... What is it? General Tao. I'm a basic bitch. I remember when I was a kid, I always loved uh, the chicken balls and like the chicken balls with General Tao chicken. Uh... I think there was like sweet and sour chicken was also pretty good. Obviously, chicken fried rice, like the most basic bitch shit ever, but it was so good. Chicken balls, you got you guys have never had chicken balls. Give me that collar. Egg rolls or spring rolls? Egg rolls. I really like, I honestly though, I do like, I do, I do like both. But if I had to choose, egg rolls are generally, are my favorite. Because spring rolls are the ones with like the wrap. It's like the see-through wrap. Those I need a very specific sauce. And I also prefer having spring rolls. Uh, with like pho. Or sorry, tha. I don't, I don't know. I call it pho. I don't give shit. But yeah, I usually like having that with pho because it's like, I don't know, it's a nice starter. It's pho. Fee fi fo fum. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Whatever it's called, I'm calling it pho. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Cook almost all your own food. I generally prefer cooking my all my own food. Like, I, I, I just never had, like, the proper kitchen to do so like i had a proper kitchen but it was like the kitchen was so dirty it was depressing to cook in like you know when you're when you know when you're cooking your food and you're like you're sitting there and you're like damn i'm gonna i'm so ready to make some like bomb ass food like yeah let's go and like you just get really excited does my food uh bleh, does my discord have a uh, food section it does <laughs> but like when you're when you're like when your kitchen is like dirty and disgusting you're just like oh thank you it got to the point where like I, I used to like clean quite a bit like i would clean like every weekend but then it got to the point where it was just like i didn't even cook anymore it was just or I, I didn't even clean anymore because I was just like, every time I cleaned, it would just get instantly dirty like two hours later. And I'm like, I give up. I give up. I'm done. I give up. <laughs> oh. Burn, baby, burn. Oh shit! Take that! You have an announcement you'd like to make? What's up? Let me let let's hear it. Eat ass? Is that your is that is that your announcement? They're engaged to a butt? Imagine being engaged to a butt. There's been weirder things out there, like somebody who got married to the Liberty Bell. Burn gas, eat ass. Where do I want to go again? I think I want to go this way. Once someone married that bell? Yup. Mm-hmm. That was a thing. Let me see if I can find it. Weirdest things people have married. Somebody married Tetris video game. This person married her duvet. This week we reported that a woman is planning to marry her duvet as she claims it is the most intimate and reliable relationship she's ever had. A woman who married a ghost of a pirate has revealed she has split from her 300 year old husband and has issued a warning. Okay. Someone married their dog. Okay, 
took her puppy love to extreme lengths when she decided to marry her pet pooch Sheba. Someone rescue that dog. <laughs> what the f- What the f- God damn. This is so laggy! Okay. Somebody married a real doll, aka they married their sex doll. Somebody married the Berlin Wall. Somebody married Sonic the Hedgehog. Somebody married My Little Pony. Ooh, dear. Somebody married Taco Bell. Somebody married Lobster Cat. Somebody married Banana Dog. Somebody married. Damn it! Nope. That's just pet ten hilarious costumes with your pets in it. I'm in a completely different section now. <laughs> Banana dog. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. But yeah, people marry some weird shit. Who says you can't have a wedding with a piece of cake? Or who says you can't have a wedding marrying a pizza? I don't know. Who says you can't? Imagine getting a divorce with that thing that you married. Like if someone was like, I'm gonna marry, I don't know, I'm gonna marry this pizza pizza. But like what would, what, what do you do? Like what you ate the piece of pizza. Like, is that a divorce? Or do you just get a new piece of pizza? But that would be like, that would be like, you'd be like a widow. That, like, that's like murder. And then you got a new wife or something. It's pizza side. No, it's a murder. Did cat murder a pizza? No. No, duh. I'm not gonna marry an olive. Eee. No. Murder and then hook up with a younger, hotter pizza? Oh, come on! That wasn't even fair. It wasn't even fair. literally passed it <clears throat> my lights broken <laughs>